Today I'm going to be reviewing Den of Thieves. It stars Gerard Butler as Big Nick, who works for this uh, major crimes unit that goes after guys who are like robbing banks, etc. And he is crazy in this movie. Like, he's usually like really strong and buff in his movies, like 300. Olympus has fallen movies, right? In this one, he guess he put on like 25 pounds to get like really big and menacing. And he is. He's one intimidating cop in this. In the opening of the movie, he's investigating a crime that happened where a bunch of guys stole an armed truck. And he's like, what the hell is going on? Why is someone stealing an armed truck? He kind of figures out and hones in on these group of guys. And these are some crazy bad guys. You got 50 Cent, you got Ice Cube's son. And this team is awesome. And you're kind of, honestly, you're kind of rooting for them because Gerard Butler's character, Big Nick, is such an asshole in this movie, right? He's a dick to his wife. He's getting divorced. Puts his job first before his family. So you almost want these guys to win. And it's this back and forth story between kind of a bad, good cop and a bunch of bad guys who, well, they're bad. I'm not saying they're good, but you see my point. Also, let's just put this out there. If you've seen Heat and love Heat, this movie is pretty much Heat, right? Heat is the ultimate, like, bank robbery movie, right? Al Pacino, you got Robert De Niro and... Yes, we don't have those actors here, but still, I think these two guys are so good and they're so great opposing guys. They're actually more realistic. Like, like I, I think this is more reality-based than Heat in some ways. So these guys are trying to break into the Federal Reserve, and I'm not going to go into how they look into doing it or what's going to happen, but let's just say it's very exciting to see how... They come up with the plan, like you're watching these characters and you're watching Gerard Butler, like trying to figure out how they're going to do it. And gradually you start to see like, oh, they're doing this. Oh, they're doing that. And it is very suspenseful. And the last 45 minutes to an hour of this movie is very tense while well, they're trying to, I'm not spoiling it, if you've seen in the trailer, like they're trying to get in their Federal Reserve. I won't go in from there, but let's just say it's very intense. Also, there is one awesome action scene where there's this crazy gunfight that does resemble the heat gunfight. The heat one is better, but this one is, this one gives you a good running for your money. Like this is a pretty darn good action scene. I thought this movie was a lot of fun. I definitely like this movie. I would give this 4.5 out of five. Thanks. By the way, this guy, damn, he got jacked in this. Like, I wish I had those guns. Realistic thriller about bank robberies. You ready? All right, I gotta go rob a bank. I'll see you guys later.